Okay, doing a quick video here uh, showing the connection and configuration of our version 18 of our uh, AccuWare uh, inventory counting app for QuickBooks. So when you first install the application, and we'll have a, an install video, but basically you just get the install button right out of the email that we'll send you when you sign up. But um, when you first uh, install it, you have to go here to run it for the first time. Okay, and you can run the application and you need to log in with your account that you've created and you would have created the account on our uh, trial page when you go to our website so let's just put the credentials in okay get started okay all right so you got to remember the connection code because you'll use that connection code on the mobile device okay um, and we've talked about that in some of the other videos but you can also get that connection code by mousing over our tray uh, icon here so you've logged into the session um, now you can always go here and do the connection okay so we're gonna go ahead and connect to uh, the company file so we'll go ahead and select the company file I'm just gonna use again that the, the uh, sample company file that we're using right now that's open uh, get connected to that and since I, I intentionally okay so we've updated that and we're connected to that company file uh, and then we're going to sync the items and the accounts and I'll review why we do that in a moment here uh, so it does that pretty quickly so we put these items up on our cloud server so that the mobile device can have much quicker response to getting the items when you're doing inventory but we'll we'll process the information back here with the quantity on hand depending on what mode you're using uh, but you do need to select an account like an asset account or um, the accounts we show here are the types of accounts that are allowed um, but uh, usually you can use like some sort of an asset account um, now the reason we need this selected is because when we do an update to the inventory you have to have an account that you're making that up update against you know so uh, it's usually uh, like an asset type of an account that you would pick um, but for now just for demo purposes I'll just grab any account but you're gonna have your own list of accounts um, save the account name so this is the account in QuickBooks that when you do inventory adjustments in QuickBooks you have to specify the account you want to use to make the adjustment against so we need to do that as well when we do our inventory adjustments so we close the screen and we're pretty much connected to QuickBooks um, so that's the steps of what's involved on the tray application just to get it so that it can work with the mobile device as you can see here when you mouse over this the connection code is 1128 so on the mobile phone you would just simply log in with the same credentials that you downloaded that you created when you created the counting app account on our web page put in those credentials and put in this connection code and you should be able to see your items and search on any of these and update the quantity on hand easily and we can work with versions of QuickBooks that do not have the advanced inventory function enabled in that case we're just updating the quantity on hand value and we're not updating that value in a location uh, but we're updating it uh, just in total um, hope this helps uh, with uh, getting your tray application installed and operating with your QuickBooks database this this tray application by the way can be installed on any QuickBooks PC that you've got that's in your facility and you can elect when you connect it to work with it with QuickBooks open on your desktop or on the server uh, or you can connect to your QuickBooks with QuickBooks closed um, you know with our label connector product most people use it well you have to use it with QuickBooks open so we don't require a server to use our counting app it can be any of your computers that have QuickBooks uh, the the QuickBooks desktop application installed on it thank you